Hello and welcome back to the Air Armoury, I'm JRH and in this extra video I'm revisiting a video series I started and finished about four years ago, Will an Air Gun Destroy? Now when I did this originally uh, the plan was to, as the name suggests, destroy something with an air gun uh, about once a week with the intention of putting out more videos as they were quick and easy to make and didn't involve a load of research or anything. I very quickly had second thoughts though as although it was fun, I felt that it moved the channel away from its intended purpose, which is providing factual content about air guns, uh, particularly older and more historical ones. So I just felt that the Will and Air Gun Destroy series uh, devalued or cheapened the channel slightly. Now I pulled the plug so quickly, I only ever actually released one video, albeit split over two parts in the end, which was Will an Air Gun Destroy a Pumpkin to tie in with Halloween 2015. But I did actually film two more videos in their entirety, just never released them, and I recently came across the footage for them. I've now decided that enough time has passed and the channel is established enough that I'm happy to release them. So I've edited the videos and what you're about to see was going to be the second video in the series, Will an Air Gun Destroy a CD. Enjoy. Hello and welcome back to the Air Armoury, I'm JRH and today I'm going to be answering the age old question, will an air gun destroy a CD? To conduct this test I'll be using that Deftone CD, the kids just couldn't agree whether it was a long single or a short album, that's right it's the Back to School EP. Now I bought the CD about 13 years ago and I haven't listened to it in around 12 and a half years so I decided it was probably expendable. I thought this was a good CD to use as it has maximum protection with this cardboard sleeve although it does just have quite a thin insert. Now my prediction is that the CD is going to get obliterated. Uh, what I'm interested to see though is whether the pellets go all the way through and out the back or whether the numerous layers of plastic and the small gaps between them kind of stop and catch the pellet midway through. I'm going to be shooting the CD with my BSA Mark IV Super Meteor in 2.2 which is fitted with a Gamo 4x20 scope. And with that I'll be using these 14.3 grain BSA Pylon number 2 pellets. Will an air gun destroy a CD? Let's find out. Okay, so let's have a look at what damage it did. As you can see, 10 quite nice neat holes on the front, but it is a different story when we get to the back. Taking some big chunks out of that. I'm gonna try and open it up and see what it looks like inside. <laughs> okay, so there's the disc. It has stayed relatively intact, uh, whether that was helped because it was kind of flat against the case I'm not sure, but as you can see some sizeable holes, considerably bigger than the 2-2 pellet that's gone through them. Uh, I think overall though it's fair to say you probably wouldn't be able to now listen to that. So will an air gun destroy a CD? It sure will. Thanks for watching, leave a comment below with any suggestions of things you'd like to see me try and destroy with an air gun, and until next time, keep rounds in the air.